Once you pick your car, I'll hand you over to Kara, your personal AI assistant. When in doubt, you can always rely on her to guide you. in a journey through Japanese car culture. Hawaii Scenic Tour. Discover, explore and photograph the hidden charms and captivating beauty of Hawaii. Nine Eleven Legacy, a Porsche story. Experience the true legacy of Porsche and keep these iconic cars pristine. Made in Japan. New playlist ahead. Let's go! We put this playlist together to give you a taste of Japanese racing culture.
Here we go. you discover almost everything the Japanese drivers have to offer. in line. We couldn't take you to Japan, so we brought Japan to you. There's a special gathering tonight at the Japanese temple. The start of a whole new experience. Here's what to expect when getting there. A traditional Japanese summer vibe and lots of Kyusha cars. Meaning iconic, classic and made in Japan. On top of this, expect some exciting encounters. That's right! Motorvest has got some killer people to introduce you to an authentic Japanese racing experience. Don't worry, you'll meet them soon enough. So you had to wait, kid. Wanna show us what you can do? Try this guy then. Japanese street racing. Let's show them, guys. Gotcha. Got it. Sure, why not? Motorfest asked us to show you how it's done, but we don't do free tours here. You gotta play your part and give us a bit of a challenge. No pressure at all. Yeah, don't scare the kid, brother. Are you familiar with the Honda you're driving? The MSX isn't your regular street car. It was made back in the 90s to stand neck and neck with the likes of Ferrari and Porsche. You sound just like Shingo. about Shingo, you know that if a rookie beats us with his NSX, we won't hear the end of it, right? I don't even want to think about giving Shingo the satisfaction. Better focus and win this thing, then. By the way, do you know what NSX stands for? New sports car experimental. I wasn't asking you, Hina. 
mood they set. Feels just like our own traditional festival back home. Looks like our guest knows how to handle a car. Interesting. Job, but the journey is far from over. Our next stop, Kaneui. The pack is waiting for you there and is willing to show you some more of the racing culture. Wangan Sen, also called Tokyo Bayshore Route, or Route B, is a famous stretch of highway for street racers. Almost every racer in the 80s and 90s knows about it. Some of the best drivers have pushed their engines on this very road. Even notorious racing groups, like the Midnight Club, cut their teeth here. And that's what slightly inspired our next event. Kid, but watch out, you're driving Ren's Skyline this time, and there's no word to tell you how crazy she is about that car. Can't blame her, the R34 is a legend. It's a kaiju. Skyline is an icon. It's a powerful car that takes skill to control. Yep, Ren spent years taming that beast. That car got nicknamed Godzilla for a reason. So basically, you crash Ren's car, better leave the planet.
perfect to get a taste of the Wangen spirit. An absolute myth among Japanese street racers. Yeah, picture the Tokyo Bayshore route with one thing in mind, never slowing down. You gotta go fast, friend. Well, guys, I don't think it's gonna be a problem. This is the skyline we're talking about. Dragons are massive. You got a wish to make? <laughs> wow, since when does a festival goer stick up to us like this? Sharp turn, careful. Time Shingo missed a turn during a midnight race, supposedly because he was dazzled by the moonlight. Oh, shut up! I remember that. shown its supremacy. Great job, but the journey is far from over. Drifting technique was perfected by Japanese gearheads who raced in the mountains in order to keep city pedestrians safe. Along with suboptimal road conditions, these mountain passes are filled with hairpin turns and other challenges. Drifting is the best way to take sharp turns without losing speed. In Japan, we call these passes toge. There's even a toge style of racing. Finding mountain roads of Hawaii are as close as we could get to Japan, so we figured it would be a good place to teach you. Features only two races. You got it. You're in for a duel.
just you and me this time. Why don't we put the whole festival euphoria on hold for a while and get a proper face off? Let me show you what Toge is all about. See what you can do. Plus, I'll give you some tips on the way. Take care of that car. Hina trusted you with it. Technique isn't easy, but when you pull it off, you feel like the greatest driver alive, and the coolest. Somebody's trying to elbow their way through. Wow, not so fast. Tricky at high speed. Make sure you don't lose control. and also the toughest part, so stay sharp. Show me some real toge driving. from over. You've just shown us how well you could use drifting techniques in a race. Now that you're all warmed up, how about a full-on drift event? coast and the view of the ocean is stunning at least that's what my databases tell me again i'm just a robot i 
hope you've liked the RX-7, because you'll be driving it again during this challenge. Except this time, she'll be waiting for you all modded and upgraded. You've seen traditional Japan, now it's time to enter the modern age. Be prepared, the contrast is stunning. racers I know. Kudos. And now, welcome to my playground, the Drift Track. As you already know, drifting was born in Japan. That is where you'll find the biggest drifting scene and some of the best drifting spots, of course. The Ebisu Circuit is one of the most famous places in the world for drifting. Designed by drifters, for drifters. Who knows? Maybe Motorfest will get you drifting there someday. How do you feel about my modded RX-7? Tougher yet still elegant? That is my RX-7 2.0 for you. Because Japanese car culture isn't only famous for its drifting history, it also brought modern cars to another level, among many other things. Come on, you're almost done. Push that beauty to its limit. You have my permission. Job, but the journey is far from over. Drifting is a popular racing style in Japan, but drag racing also gets its fair share of gearheads. There's a drag spot set up not too far from here. This runway is one of the best places to drag race on the island. Warm up your engine and don't blink. This will be a quick one.
job, driver. New challenges lie ahead. We can't really get a taste of modern Japanese car culture without some proper urban racing and seriously modern customs. The streets of Honolulu at night should set the perfect stage for these final races Motorfest has prepared for you. for the Made in Japan experience. Out of this world, customs owning the city. Okay, you're not here to fool around. Noted. Well, you got your wish. Everybody's car is on top of their game, especially your new ride. Toji's Mitsubishi Lancer Evo X. Yeah, Toji's the craziest customizer of us all. He loves his cars big and mean. previously known as Concept X and Prototype X, is the final form of the Lancer Evolution Theory. It's the most technologically advanced Evo ever. Another JDM gem. You're welcome. Toji would say it's the best of them all. Go for a driver. This car was made to be first only. Scratches to a minimum, shall we? reverse gear. It has two forward gears working together to make the wheels rotate in the opposite way. Cool, huh? And that's how you save on weight. Precisely.
That Motorfest crew knows how to throw a party. Don't get too excited. You're just a host in that fantasy. Watch out. Hosts can be dangerous, Mrs. Abernathy. Hey, I got that, ref. Nerds, both of you. Just a few seconds away, guys. It's now or never. This was the Mitsu Lancer Evo X with a special Toji Custom. And you just showed you're totally worthy of that car. the following event. with a special car. Have fun! to get.
car for this race. What a ride. Courtesy of the Motorfest, I presume. A pumped up Toyota Supra 880. A solid choice. Could it be more appropriate, actually? The Supra was specifically designed at the time to rival most of our cars. Skyline, NSX, or RX-7. And that customization looks flawless. Pretty cool. But remember, nothing beats the R34. Funny way to pronounce NSX. Go for a driver. This car was made to be first only. Shinjuku style, huh? Well, we'll see about that. You gotta admit, it feels just like Tokyo. Well, I guess they did do a pretty good job capturing the vibe of our streets. didn't get to drive high as MX-5. Fair point. Who knows? Another time, maybe. There's still so much about Japanese racing we didn't touch on. Are we talking, guys, or are we showing our new member who the top dogs are in this pack? Did you get that driver? He said let's punch it! being a motor best legend a new reward is waiting for you within the activity menu don't forget to grab your reward vehicle driver
last surprise for you, driver. Let's head back to the container. Playlist cleared and ready for takeoff, driver. 